just want to find out if chemo and radiation is effective in treating it. It's not. I mean, in people, the response rates for chemo and radiation are typically less than 20 percent. And you know, you know, in people, unless something is working at least 30, 40 percent of the time, it's it's not considered to be an option. Uh -huh. um, there haven't really been any good. Um, large studies done on dogs evaluating the effects of radiation and, and uh, chemo, but you know there is info out there that would say that it's just like people. Okay. You know, and the same thing goes with osteosarcoma is that um, you know if you try to irradiate osteosarcoma, you're generally not killing the cancer, you're just treating the symptoms, mm -hmm. you know what I mean? The pain. Um, you know, chemotherapy, although that does work with osteo, I think it's different because chondrosarcomas tend to grow a lot slower. Mm -hmm. um, but, uh, you know, take that out of the equation. Yeah, I still do think that chondrosarcomas are, are much more resistant to treatment uh, compared to other tumors. So, unless there is an absolute, you know, significant reason why we should give them chemo, you know, it's hard for me to recommend it because it doesn't work in people, and based on what we know, in theory, it's probably not going to work in dogs, mm -hmm. uh, or at least the majority of dogs. But if it's one of those situations where it's already spread, and you know the dog has months to live, and you know it's a one in you know 200 chance that the chemo is going to work, if those are okay with you know slim odds, then sure, I, I don't see a reason why we couldn't try. Mm -hmm. Because at the doses we prescribe for animals, odds are we're not going to hurt them. Possible, but odds are we're not. Mm -hmm. You know, it, it's more of are we going to really help them? But yeah, we, we, I tend to steer owners away from chemo radiation for chondrosarcomas, mainly because there's nothing out there saying that it works. What do you give them instead? Surgery. I mean, surgery is really the hallmark of treatment. Mm -hmm. And don't get me wrong, there are exceptions. You know, if we're not doing surgery and they're painful, we can irradiate it because the radiation uh, does alleviate discomfort, mm -hmm. but it's not because we're treating the tumor. Uh, it's because we're treating what the tumor is doing to the patient. Okay. Chemotherapy for big bulk disease, you know, definitely not going to work. You know, wouldn't you know, think about mentioning it to an owner. Okay. It would really be designed to treat metastatic disease. Um, but even that, I would really have to caution the owner that, you know, it's a long shot. You know, it, it might still might be worth the risk in their mind, but they really have to know it's a long shot.